Hey everybody, it's Ramona. Welcome back. Uh, looking a bit of a mess, but I wasn't feeling good e earlier today. We had some vomiting episodes. So I had a nap and I feel okay now. Um, I have some iced coffee right here and it seems to be staying down okay. But we're here to talk candles, which is always good news. So this is a box of candles. This is from Illum, which I've never had any Illum candles before. Um, I was watching Keeping Up With Kaylee the other day and um, she, she hauled a couple candles and Kaylee has a coupon code uh, that Illum was kind enough to for her to share with her subscribers. So I jumped on the coupon code. I believe it was 15%, I can't remember. Um, and I tried to find my, my invoice, but I must have deleted it. I don't know what I did. But anyway, and I think most of these ones that I ordered were out of the sale section. So go to Kaylee's website. I'm gonna link the, the uh, her video down below and then you will can find the, coup the coupon code in her description in her video. So I've only cut up the box. I've not uh, dived into it yet. So there's one in here that she specifically recommended and it didn't come in full size. So I have to get, I have to get a little teeny one. So let's, let's just get them all out of the box first. That will save some time. And then we will go from there. So I'm kind of excited to try something new. And also I will have a Bath and Body Works candle haul coming up soon too, because I don't understand this whole time uh, that Bath and, that we've, the country has been shut down. The world has been shut down. Um, and Bath and Body Works website has been open. That would have been, people aren't going into the stores. That would have been a perfect time to have like a candle day, candle sale like every single day just to keep, you know, to keep their sales up. And so I, they didn't. But one day last week, um, maybe it was the day the stores opened. I'm not sure. They did have a $10 off um, coupon for Bath and Body Works candles. And I've not ordered anybody's candles. I'm trying to think when, it's been a while, it's been a while. So I did order some Bath and Body Works candles. Hopefully they will perform well. And uh, you know, I, I'm not in, fall winter is really my jam. I don't have a lot of spring summer candles. Like last fall, I did an inventory of my candle collection and like 75% of my candles were fall, winter, and very few spring, summer. So I will be, I did add a few spring, summer ones um, to my collection. Okay, we're all unwrapped and ready to go. Um, let me pull up the website and just, so that I can read some scent descriptions. Uh, I should have done this before, to do. Sorry, I'm always like, you know, day late and a dollar short, as they say. That would be me. Okay. So, okay, here we go. And, oh, look at this now. Um, the, if you go to the Illum website right now, there is up to 60% off recent markdowns. So, so that's a really good reason to shop for some candles right then and there. All right. Okay, so this is the one, let's see. Yes, this is the one, Coconut Milk Mango. This is the one that Kaylee said was so good um, but it didn't come in the big size. It only came in the small tin. So let's see what the scent notes are. Um, island pineapple, freshly sliced mango, lush papaya, and coconut milk are infused with sugar cane and Tahitian vanilla. This is 2.5 ounce tin and it was $4 minus the 15%. I think it was 15% uh, coupon code. And the coupon code did work on the sale items. So that's good to know too. Ooh, oh, yeah. Okay, don't do this on a 100 degree day. Not a good idea. That's nice. It's very fruity, but I do get, um, I definitely get coconut and a little bit of pineapple, a little bit of mango. 
And uh, I'm not huge on super fruity things, but the coconut milk kind of tones it down. So that's really good. And just today, I had a little Glade Amber uh, candle burning in my half bath right here. So that will go in there. Then I also ordered Rustic Pumpkin. And this is a 4.9 ounce tin. And let's see where you are. Rustic Pumpkin. This was $7.00. Notes of pumpkin, nutmeg, and sandalwood usher in warm, inviting moments of the season. Oh, that's nice. I don't know, can you see the wax is starting to melt there? It's like, it was, we had a heat advisory today. Uh, with the heat index, it was gonna be 107 to 111, somewhere in there, it's, it's hot. This is really nice. Wow, do you know what this reminds me of? This is really, really close to smoked pumpkin woods. I need to go back and see if they have this in a bigger size. Oh yeah, that's really, really good. I'm really excited uh, to melt this one, to burn this one. I'll save that though. I only have that one smoked pumpkin woods left. I pray to the candle gods and to Harry Slacken, please bring back, well, Harry, I guess you could say, some would say he's the candle god, uh, to please bring, bring back smoked pumpkin woods. So we shall see. Okay, this one is Citron Star Jasmine. Um, let's see, right here. This is um, 11.8 ounces, and this was on sale for $10. Um, lemon, lime, and clementine blend with pink jasmine and cedar wood for a spring in your step freshness. This is a three wick candle. The others were uh, one wicks. Oh, that is very nice. That is, do you know what jumped out at me first was the lime. I'm definitely getting the lime first. Lime, a teensy bit of floral and the warmth of the cedar wood. But lime really comes out first. That is really, really nice. I can't wait to melt, to burn that one. Then I have this little trio. Um, is this it? Wood fire, maybe not, let me see. Yes, okay, the wood fire mini collection. Okay, so this is, um, this was $18 and it is three 2.5 ounce candles, like that, single wick. They are, Um, it looks kind of like mercury glass there as I look through my bifocals. So are they all the same? Yes, I think they're all the same. Yep, they're all the same. Seductive cedar wood and smoke, uh, let me start over. Seductive cedar wood and smoke accords mixed with heady patchouli leaves and warm vanilla to kindle the ultimate fireside fragrance. This is really nice. Definitely, I'm getting patchouli out of this. They're really soft. I don't want to mess around with them too much. Definitely, I'm getting patchouli. And the cedar wood, kind of a woody patchouli note. Those are really nice. Now, it's funny how my scents have, my scent preferences have changed. And somebody on my uh, Bring Back My Bar video also noted it. She said, it's funny because last year you didn't like coconut. Um, what was, what is it? I have it right here. Yeah, coconut cotton. Last year, I wasn't a fan of this one, but this year I am, look, I put a C in it for my club. It's, and last year I didn't like amber. Last year I didn't like lavender. So the more I'm kind of experimenting and letting myself try new things, uh, the more I find that I'm liking certain blends of lavender and amber and, and different things that I, you know, would not have tried in the past. So, um, interesting, but, okay, let's see. This is, this is a little wet on the top. Yes, this is juniper moss. Okay, this is juniper moss. This is like in a textured ceramic vessel. It is, um, let's see, it is 
14 ounces and it was $13 again, minus the 15 cents. I mean, at 15% and uh, juniper moss. And I love the smell of juniper. Crisp balsam mixes with mossy earth, warm amber, and a touch of smooth vanilla bean. Oh yeah, that's nice. And the uh, there's a little, you know, paper thing that is, here we go. It's soft because it's a little bit melted. Oh, very nice. Definitely like woodsy, amber. Uh, I can't get, really get the vanilla bean right now, but that's really nice. Woodsy, mossy, amber, kind of all kind of together. So I'm looking forward to that. I'll probably, I guess I will, uh, I don't know. I'll burn it when I feel like it. How do you like them apples? And whoops, finally, sorry, Stella. Finally, we have, and this one also is melted on there. Okay, I'm not gonna mess with it. And I have another one in the same design, and this one is Winter Mint. And the set notes in this one are Snow Frosted Blossoms. Oh, I can, I can smell it. Snow frosted blossoms are surrounded by fir needles, crisp lemon, and dewy eucalyptus. Definitely get the um, the fir needles first. Not really getting any lemon, maybe a little bit of eucalyptus. So hopefully, I'm really hoping the lemon will come out with the fir needles. I think that would be a very interesting blend. So I'm looking forward to that too. So again, this is my Illum haul. I've never had any Illum candles, so I'm hoping that the burns will be okay. So if, let me know if you have any experience with Illum. And I'm going to link Kaylee's video down below. That's where you'll find the coupon go code as well. Hopefully it's still valid. And yeah, I think that's it for now. Um, I'm excited to try a new brand, so looking forward to it. So that's it. I hope everybody's having a great day. I'll see you soon. Bye.